Remember when I said this? So I've now done a video for Niall. I've done a video for Zane. Now I've done a video for Louie. Still haven't done one for Harry or Liam. It would be weird to do a video for Harry right now since I've already listened to all of his albums. Probably not because this is probably your first time watching one of my videos. You should subscribe by the way. Regardless, we're not really overdue for any new Harry Styles music for the next foreseeable future. <laughs> somebody, and I don't know how, managed to get their hands on an unreleased Harry Styles song called Talk. And apparently a snippet of this song has been around for a while now, but just five days ago, the entire song leaked on YouTube. Now I'm not gonna lie, I read some YouTube comments for some context because I don't know too much about Harry Styles, and it sounds like this was supposed to be on his first album. And everyone is raging saying, oh my So when I listen to the song, I hope to feel the exact same way because I have listened to that album before. Okay, I'm kind of nervous. This video only has 64,000 views. For some reason, I expected more. I know how big his fandom is. Let's listen to Talk. This feels like a little bit of grunge. Yeah, this is like 100% grunge. This feels like a Pearl Jam song. Oh, what does that remind me of? What does that remind me of? Oh my god. I, uh, I couldn't think of it in the moment. I feel like I've not heard drums like this on any Harry Styles song. Obviously, like, the quality of the song isn't as good because it's a leak. So I can't really get the full effect in these headphones. Love me a good Harry Styles screech. Oh my god. A little guitar solo? Oh my god. Oh wow, that's it. Oh my god. That is the first ever unreleased Harry Styles song I've heard. What the heck? How are you gonna scream your heart out into the mic like that and keep it in the archives? I mean, wh what are you doing all that for? At least sell the song to someone else if you're not gonna use it. Like, maybe sell it to One Direction for a comeback single. Just maybe. From what I remember about his first album, that song, in terms of sound, felt a lot like Only Angel and it felt a lot like Kiwi. So it would have definitely fit in the album. The album is only 10 songs. So it can't be that the song wouldn't have fit on the album because it went with the sound and the album only had 10 songs. So it definitely could have used an 11th. What was it, Harry? What was it? Tell me. Whenever he would scream in that song, I swear I wasn't hearing the song in my ears. I was hearing it in my stomach and as he screamed, the sound shot up to my ears. I actually don't know if I could have described that in a weirder way. At least I didn't say it felt like he was inside me. Anyways, if you want to see me react to Medicine or another unreleased song, tell me. But that's the one thing about unreleased songs. I will listen to it one time, and then after that, if it's not on Spotify, I'm not gonna listen to it. If I can't put it in my playlist, then what's the freaking point? Oh, goodness, Harold. Have a blessed rest of your day. Make me feel brand new.